Welcome, 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 Pisces! Pisces! Oh my god, Pisces, I'm always singing. Why you when Pisces? Pisces, I love you guys. Alright, Pisces, this is the energy of the Gemini. And um Gemini could be helping you guys out. This is the season of the Gemini, and the Geminis could be really, really helping you Pisces out. So um, be aware of this. All right. So what we're seeing, Pisces, is that um, this is the Gemini season and you're dealing with the most important thing. You are going to be happy in the week of the 21st until the 27th. Whatever is happening and transpiring, Pisces, yay, yay, yay. Um, do you want a new contract? Do you want a new department? Are you going to go get a new position, a new car? Um unexpected business offer is going to be coming in. You are going to be changing the way that you do business, love your business, whatever that was blocking your business. You're going to be releasing the, this blockage. Oh my God, can um, Pisces. And um, the week of the 21st until the 27th is your best and only week. That is good. Um, indulging eight of cups. So, so I see a lot of you are going to be turning your back oh, to an Aries Leo or Sagittarian. Whoever this Aries Leo or Sagittarian is, so you're going to be overcoming this Aries Leo or Sagittarian. This is a young man between the age of 18 and 45. And I see um, you could be firing this person or um, getting rid of this person because uh, this person is not uh, performing as you had expected, okay? Um, this person could have been creating a whole lot of issue. Whoever this person is has created a whole lot of issue for you. Now, Pisces, the first week and the third week is going to be good. The last week is a, is a week where you're going to be enduring some sort of a struggle because the last week you could be hearing of some sort of an ending um for a fire sign person and this is some sort of an ending for a leo um in the last week you're going to be recognizing that a leo contract or a leo that was open for some sort of a new business deal or business contract is no longer on the table for this leo whoever this leo is this leo is an um a man between the ages of 25 and 50, whoever this Leo man is, you're going to be getting over this Leo man because this Leo man could have created a whole lot of problems in your life, Pisces. And this Leo man have created a whole lot of imbalances in your life. And now you are really resolving the situation because you recognize the unfair um, game that this Leo man was creating and how this Leo man has gotten you in some sort of a serious problem. So um, Pisces, let's go in your reading. So the first week you have one of the best, best, best nine of cups, nine of cups, nine of cups. And the energy of the nine of cups is Jupiter in Pisces. So Pisces, whatever you were open for, Business-wise, whatever, the week of the 21st till the 27th, it is a yes week. Go for it. Do it. Do whatever you are open for. Some of you, um, the, you know, unexpected luck. It is a lucky week for you in business and uh, um, at the workplace. It's an extremely, extremely lucky week. A lot of you Pisces are going to be successful in this week. You're going to be um, recognizing and resolving a whole lot a lot of you have been waiting for this lucky break and in the week of the 21st or the 27th, this lucky break is going to be coming in, especially Pisces that was dealing with an Aries Lee or a fire sign man. Um, you're going to be luckily overcoming this person and get in out and separating yourself from this person because of what this person have done. You is as if the universe came in and really uh, remove you, this person from you. In the second week, the week of the 28th until the 3rd, what we recognize is that a lot of you are dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarian man. Now, it can be also a female energy, but it's coming up as a man. The masculine energy can be a female that have more masculine energy. And whoever this person is and whatever that is transpiring, this person has created a whole lot of chaos 
for you guys and chaos that you're going to be ending. You are going to be firing this person. You're going to be um, standing your ground against this person. And this person has created not only chaos, but a whole lot of emotional problems. You, This person um, let you feel as if you don't want to be at work. This person has created so much issues for you and you know now their time is here their time is here and then a lot of you pisces is going to be so happy that their time is now here because whatever this person has done has gotten you pisces in a whole lot of problem and now they're recognizing what this person have done and you are like Thank God they kind of figure out what this person have been creating and the issues and problems that this person have created. And I had nothing to do with it. So it's as if um, a lot of you Pisces is going to be recognizing this person have to go. And I see this person is looking at you as if, hey, Pisces, can you help me? And you were like, nope. <laughs> you Pisces are like, nope. I am so happy. Um, this situation is now over because you have nearly cost me um, my job and my business. Uh, no, sorry. Um, you know, I, you know, and the thing about this is that you're not telling this person, I'm sorry, I'm, I can't help you. But you already decide your mind. No, I'm not helping this person. Um, they have cost me my job. They have cost me my my wealth they have cost me um my financial flow they were draining my financial flow <clears throat> so i see a lot of you are going to be not telling this person but just uh letting them down slowly whether um you're easing them down as saying you know there's not enough hours or no i didn't get any result from you know, you were looking for a job for them and that sort of a thing. But I see you letting down this fire person very, very gently. As we look at the third week, the third week is from the fourth until the 10. The fourth until the 10, you are dealing with the eight of cups, Saturn in Pisces. So there we are, Pisces. Um, Some of you... Um, could be getting the message of uh, um, that a position has ended um, for an Aries Lee or a Sagittarian. And, you know, some of you could be regretting it, but yet still some of you could be what? A very surprise a moment is coming in for um, you Pisces where you know this 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 news is going to be um coming out of the blues for some of you Pisces, but it's about discipline. Saturn in Pisces is about ending, and it's for some of you is going to be a happy one because uh, you're going to be receiving the news that a Aries or fire sign person between the ages of twenty five and fifty is going to be leaving. Now, for some of you, it's going to be costing you extra because then you have to put in extra in your work but for some of you you are going to be whoa okay i never see this coming um all right so what now so a lot of you are going to be finding out something it could be about an ex-co-worker an ex colleague or it could be about a fire sign person that was secretly pulling um the 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 the, the pulling the carpet from under your foot and you weren't even aware of this. And then uh, the news is going to be coming in and said, Hey, do you know that so-and-so is going out uh, is leaving? And you're going to be saying what? And he said, Oh, you should be happy because if you ever know what they did, did you know that they were the one that makes you didn't get this promotion and you're going to be what? But I've always been good to this person. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the world of uh, people smiling with you, not really meaning it, and was gently, gently pulling the carpet. So it could be an ex colleague. It could be an ex colleague who, in um, you're going to be hearing, oh, you know that they are fired or their contract was not renewed or they're leaving. 
and you're going to be, mm, okay. So for you, Pisces, it's going to be positive emotion because it's going to be positive emotion about a fire sign person that has done you some sort of an injustice in the past. So it could be a whole lot of you are going to be finding out something about an old co-worker that they are leaving. And then you're going to be finding out that you got fired because of this old co-worker or your contract was not renewed because of this old co-worker. But, you know, it is like the universe is saying, hey, Pisces, I got to give this to you. I got to give you this emotional to um, for you to understand that someone who pulled the rug from under your foot by another company, the rug is now pulled from under their foot. So it's it's like, and it's, 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 um, it's a sweet justice, a sweet justice for a lot of you, Pisces. All right, so let's move forward. The last week is the week of endurance. It is the week of uh, you finding inner strength, okay? Enduring a situation what a Sagittarian and a Leo has done to you, um, Pisces. And somehow you, Pisces, had got in contact or in connection with a Sagittarian and a Leo. And whoever the Sagittarian and Leo is, I've created a chaos for you. And that is, you know, this, this, this is a situation where a Sagittarian and a Leo could really get you fired. So look at the contract and the endurance under the energy of the ring. So let's say that you are open for some sort of a new contract. Look under the energy of the ring um, because you're going to be finding out that if you do not get this contract or disagreement, it has to do with a Sagittarian and a Leo that has created a whole lot of problem because I see you are enduring a situation. Okay, so look, you know, if it's that is a contract, look under um, the energy of the ring that, you know, if you were waiting, but you're going to be finding out that a Leo and a Sagittarian um, is being fired or the contract is being um, cancelled because of something that they have done. So you see the energy of the Aries, the or fire sign person here. Um, and, you know, you are safe, Pisces, because uh, the endurance is dealing with them. Okay. So they could be fired and it's trying to create chaos for you. But you're going to be enduring this because... Um, you know, people do not understand, but every action and every reaction, you got to pay your dues, ladies and gentlemen. And that is what is transpiring now. Wow, Pisces, this is beautiful. So, you know, your first week and your third week is just going to be powerful because your first week, um, you will have the energy of uh, um, uh, Jupiter in Pisces. So that is a lucky week. And um, the third week, you have Saturn in Pisces. Um, so you Pisces could be ending and creating balance between you and some co-worker um, that Aries, Leo, is fire sign. And it's coming up as Sagittarian and Leo that you had to endure. Okay, so be aware of this. I do love you guys. I gotta go, but I'm saying namaste until next time.